all, I'd like to welcome everyone that's here to this first uh, Falcon Road Festival. Um, originally planned by the big local SW11, but now a much larger committee. Everybody involved, lots of groups. Okay, so London Fire Brigade is celebrating 150 years uh, anniversary and all the station managers within London Fire Brigade have been tasked with putting on a party to celebrate it. Uh, I was at a meeting with um, Senya Dedic and uh, we were discussing about what we could do in, in uh, the Batsy area and she mentioned to me that Christchurch School were also celebrating 150 years uh, of education and also that uh, Robert Musgrave uh, was desperate to put a, uh, a festival on in Falcon Road. And I thought, well, let's all get together uh, and put on the biggest party we can. Ladies and gentlemen, Battersea Fire Station is celebrating its uh, 150th anniversary in conjunction with London Fire Brigade today. The fire station will be open from 12 o'clock till 6 o'clock and the firefighters will be demonstrating various uh, firefighting techniques that they use within your local community. Big smile, bigger than that. <laughs> In the big local SW11 committee uh, was founded over two years ago with a vision and action plans for all sorts of areas such as achieving the potential and safety and well-being and we wanted to make sure that we're doing things for our local residents and all those things. And as part of that local community and belonging we have said we wanted to start having festivals in Falcon Road. Uh, hello and very good morning. Um, we're here at the Falcon Road Festival and I'm here with the National Army Museum's uh, tented encampment. We're here today to promote and commemorate the First World War, uh, in particular the Commonwealth efforts during the Battle of the Somme, which of course on the 1st of July uh, this year will be 100 years since that fateful battle. Today we're also celebrating 55 years of Falcon Estate and also 10 years of forming the Falcon Estate Residents Association. Well, we get involved with big local by just helping out where we can. So we've got given leaflets to help about programs to hand out just to the general public so they know what's going on. I'm from Wandsworth Police Cadet um, and we are here to basically volunteer and help out to any stalls if they want. And this is our card and we are going to have our stall later on as well. Uh, this festival has actually been funded by the big local SW11 and big local SW11 has been given some money by National Lottery to make improvements in the area. Quite a lot of the groundwork has been done by the um, Battersea Fire Station Commander, um, Nick. So our secretary Laura lives at the end of the road and she heard about it and we've been looking for somewhere to fundraise. Um, we raise money for ourselves and for the Women's Refuge in Wandsworth. We're very, very proud to support the Falcon Road Festival. It's a marvellous community event. Local businesses promoting their wares and local organisations like the Battersea Crime Prevention Panel supporting this festival. Let's hope the sun shines and we all have a lovely day. I am happy to this festival because people are very nice, location very nice. I love this place. Thank you very much. It's open to anyone, but especially for the people like myself who live on the Falcon, Falcon Road, and for all the people that win Stanley, I think it's going to be wonderful. I just hope the rain keeps off. It's been wonderful with the support that the London Fire Brigade have been given, given to us for the event, but also the love that people have sort of given back to them, saying how much they appreciate them. The fact that it's been for 150 years. And Christchurch School, again, 150 years. Absolutely fabulous, talented staff who've given up their time on a Saturday and the children that have come. They've had over 100 children here that have celebrated 150 years. Each year group had about a 30 year period to share with everybody and the steel pans were absolutely fantastic. It's going to be great this festival, so many years ago, and I'm 92, and it brings back a lot of memories to me. These photographs you see around here are trace 
the development of the area since uh, mid 19th century, 1850, mid Victoria. It's great to be here today at the uh, Falcon Road Heritage Festival, particularly enjoying looking at these fabulous old photographs of uh, my constituency. Um, so much has happened in Battersea over the last hundred years, and uh, you know it's really fascinating to see places, almost places are actually stood in here, what they look like. Uh, some years ago because obviously this area has changed a great deal, uh, particularly after the war. So, you know, this is fascinating, but there's also lots of other great things going on here. Really fantastic to see the effort that uh, Big Local have made, the team locally have made to bring this festival together. I've uh, just bought a bird box from a lovely, uh, the lovely Men in Sheds uh, project. Uh, I'm looking forward to uh, spending a few more, uh, a few more minutes looking around and uh, and uh, hearing about pe what people are doing. That's all my life, yeah. Yeah. I've got it written all over my body. <laughs> well, what, do you have some tattoo of his Battersea on it? Yes. Yeah. I am a Battersea born and bred person, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we encourage like young people to come. Yeah, um, I've got the big local SW11 badge and, to and um, today I'm going to be reporting about this festival. I was asked to set up Cop at Close as part of the festival. So I think I, I think they gave me four weeks to do what I could. Um, we've got a DJ that's on all day. We've got food vendors. We've got bungee run. We've got the teacups for the children. Um, we've got a magnificent raffle going on. Face painting. We've got um, stalls for children with disabilities, uh, such as autism and ADHD. We've got um, Louise, who's an artist. She's done all, bought all our artwork with her. I'm um, here for my artwork, which is very bright and colourful and lively. Um, and it's lively and bright and colourful here today. We're having lots of fun. Uh, community's all out. And yeah, it's time to celebrate. Um, I'm from A2I Dyslexia, and I'm at the Falcon Road um, um, Festival. And it's really awesome. It's amazing. We've met some really lovely people. and. Um, we're having fun! It's been a brilliant day, it's a pity about the weather, but it's been really nice seeing so many people from so many parts of the, of the borough here, so many different, um, the, from the shops to the police to children, it's, it's just been a real mixture, it's been brilliant. and I'm with Scorpion Kit Boxing. We're having a great day at the festival. The kids are absolutely loving coming and trying it out. As you can see, they're really enjoying it. A lot of the kids uh, seem to be very passionate about it as well. And all in all, the sun's out, so it's been a good day. Hello, this is a fantastic festival. Um, it's uh, commemorating Armed Forces Day. I've met some wonderful people here in the local community. Wonderful stands, great charities, just fantastic. And I think that the Fire Brigade and all the organizers need to be congratulated. I thoroughly enjoyed my afternoon and thank you so much for inviting me along. Thank you. We're here teaching everybody from little kids to big kids to adults circus skills. And um, we were invited to come here and take part in this amazing day. I'm looking forward to, um, to learn some new stunts and maybe put, um, become a little famous. 
Uh, I really like these sort of ideas of opening up the community, having fun, exciting things on the streets where everybody can come and have a go, changing the landscape, um, getting them to think about different spaces in different ways. I think it's really amazing. Um, fingers crossed that it stays sunny and that everybody can come and enjoy it. What do you think about the festival? Well, I think the festival is a very good idea. I think it's fantastic because what it does is it shows the local community and everyone else all the positive sides of the community. And I think people like to focus on negative things and they forget about all of the things that are going really, really well. All the guys we've got here working here today are all volunteering their own time to try and help the community. So I think it's something, something for us to feel very positive about and something for everyone else to feel positive about. And I get to be interviewed by people like you. We brought around our boxing ring because that's what we do and we just had them all in there working some pad work, doing some one-two rolls, ten seconds non-stop punching. It was just a case of just letting them let off some steam. We have a charity-based organisation that help disadvantaged, hard to reach youths to bring them back into society with boxing to give them encouragement to get confidence and hopefully also get them into work. Hi everyone, um, we're today here at um, Heritage Festival in Falcon Road. Um, I work for Stepping Stones. Um, we decided to come along and uh, show what we do. Um, we're a local clinic just down the road in Falcon Road. Uh, we're quite happy to be here in the festival because it's an opportunity for people to meet, meet everyone on the spot and also people to get together because many times we live around the corner from each other but we don't know who's who. So it's a great um, day for people to get to know what businesses and services are around. And I'm quite happy to take part of that. We've come along, it's a fantastic event, lots of community stuff going on. Um, the weather has been absolutely fantastic and also absolutely miserable. Um, right now the sun is shining and uh, I hope that everyone can make the most of it. Today has been absolutely fantastic. It has been an, a wonderful event where so many community organisations have come together and there's been nothing but love. Nothing but people just uh, appreciating, learning about each other, appreciating the food and the drink and just interacting and chatting with people. Jerk chicken, bison, finger licking, come over and have some. I really hope next year they really do this again. Because I loved it, I had loads of fun. Just a great day for family out. The festival today was, it was absolutely superb. There was a lot of hard work going into planning it. Um, and it was superb. This is the first time we've done one on such a very large scale, doing it on the Falcon Road and also taking in Shillenden Park, um, which will be going on into the evening. Normally the, the festival will be over by now, but because we're doing it in Shillenden Park, it's going on until later on tonight. Uh, overall it's been fantastic organised. I've met so many people. Uh, and I'm, I'm kind of really proud of what we've all done together as a community. It's been a community engagement session that I think I'll never forget for the rest of my life.